welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of a piece of Cartier jewelry. This piece of jewelry was actually gifted to me for my birthday from my husband and I've been really excited about it and I just wanted to come on here and share it with all of you. The way that I'll do the unboxing is I'll show you guys all of the packaging that came with the piece of jewelry. Then I'll talk about the different styles that this piece of jewelry comes in and the new model that was just released this year in 2017 the sizing, and then finally how to care for this piece of jewelry. So before we get into all of that fun stuff, I just wanted to say hi to anyone who is new to my channel. I'm so happy that you're here, and I would love it for you to hit the subscribe button down below. That way you're notified every time that I upload a new video. Okay, so let's get into this unboxing. This piece of jewelry actually came in a white box because my husband ordered this piece of jewelry online. But I no longer have the white box because he sent it off to be engraved and they actually sent the jewelry back in an envelope like this. So I'll insert a picture of what the white box looks like. So that's what the box looks like and then inside of the box there was an envelope like this and on the back it says Cartier. And then if we open it up, There they have their crest embossed right here and on the bottom it says Cartier. And then if we open it up this way, he had a personalized card written for me right here. And then in the back was just kind of like your order information and then the certificate of authenticity. And then if we open up the certificate of authenticity, It says Cartier and it has a textured front on it and it's really hard case like almost a passport holder and then on the inside of it it just has all of the serial numbers that are for my piece of jewelry. The next thing that was in the box was a red Cartier bag and it has a rope style handle and also a piece of gold hardware on one side. They also sent me a couple of samples of perfume in this little box. I have yet to smell them. Um, but here they are. They sent two samples. And then finally they sent the item in this box right here. And it was wrapped in white paper and it had the wax seal crest Cartier um, emblem right there. And so if I open it up, slide it out. And here is the box and it says Cartier. And it's a very hard, sturdy box. And then there's another box inside of the box. And so if we open it up, we just press this little button right here. And I was gifted the Love Bracelet in 18 karat yellow gold. And it came with the screwdriver. And for those of you who aren't familiar with the Love Bracelets, they are actually and two separate pieces so there's a top piece and a bottom piece and the person who loves you and bought the bracelet for you is supposed to take the screwdriver and put the two pieces of the bracelet together and then lock it onto your wrist. There is a screw right here and there is a screw on this side right here to lock the bracelet onto your wrist. And the screwdriver actually came in this Cartier plastic right here so it wouldn't fall out and scrape up the bracelet and that was placed inside of a velvet holder and this is like a travel case that you can bring along with you and it says Cartier right there. So there are a bunch of different models of this bracelet. There are ones that have diamonds, there are some that have, are fully encrusted in diamonds. My bracelet is just the regular 18 karat yellow gold bracelet. It comes in yellow gold, rose gold, which they call pink gold, and also white gold. And this year, in 2017, they have just released a new model, and it is a thinner version of this bracelet right here. So it's about half the width of this bracelet, and it looks absolutely gorgeous as well. As for the sizing of these bracelets, it definitely depends on what type of person you are and how you would want your bracelet to fit. I went with the size 17 in my bracelet, and they measure their bracelets in centimeters and my wrist actually measured 15 centimeters. So I went two sizes up because I wanted mine to be a little bit more of a loose fit. If I wanted it more of a snug fit, I would have went with a size 16. 
But any bracelet or piece of jewelry that you're thinking of purchasing from Cartier, I definitely recommend going into the boutique and trying it on and letting them get your size and what they think would fit you best if you are thinking about purchasing something from their store. As for caring for this bracelet, I've been wearing mine every day since it was locked onto my wrist and it does have a couple of scratches already, but I did purchase these Nike sweatbands to put on my wrist whenever I'm doing cleaning and things like that just to give the bracelet a little layer of extra protection and that seems to have been working out for me. And you can also bring your bracelet to be cleaned by Cartier, but they only recommend that you bring it into them a couple of times during the lifetime of the bracelet because every time that you bring it in and they buff it out, it does get a layer of gold taken off of it. So that is just something to keep in mind if you are thinking about investing in one of these bracelets. But that about wraps it up for this video, you guys. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you back here. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next one. Bye. Bye.